There's new information tonight. Funeral arrangements are made for a green country couple killed in a plane crash in Arkansas. Ivan and Adina Williams' celebration of life will be this Saturday at the Burdick Center in Pryor at 1 p.m. A reception will follow at the Expo Center. Now, a day after responders found their bodies in the wreckage, residents in Pryor remember Ivan and his wife Adina. 2 News reporter Liz Bryan is in Pryor to show us how the couple impacted their town. Liz. Well, good evening, Russ. This is just one place that Adina and Ivan impacted. Now here at Pryor Centennial Park, you would never know who donated these 10 acres because there's no plaque since Ivan and Adina didn't want it that way. But it's the same park that residents are remembering and recognizing their lives at by tying these white ribbons onto all the trees. Now, just earlier today, we met up with another Ivan, Ivan Pace, and he says the best compliment of his life is when people mixed up the two because of their names, especially when Ivan Williams III served as city councilor for Pryor. Pace, friends with the whole Williams family for the last 60 years, calls Ivan the Will Rogers of Pryor and wished he could tell him one final goodbye. I'd shake hands with him and say, you know, I've, I've watched your life, probably have tried to copy it a little bit, and I appreciate you letting me know you. Pryor's mayor says along with this park, the Williams opened the town's rec center. Ivan was the driving force behind getting all the money together, and without him, the tennis courts and swimming pool wouldn't exist. Ivan ran Williams Construction as the president of the company. His father founded it right here in Pryor. And instead of profiting off this land, developing it for homes, Ivan and Adina donated the land back in 2003 for a park. And some residents now want to ask the mayor if the park can be named after the couple as a memorial. Live and prior Liz Bryant, 2 News, works for you.